Hi, my name is Jacques Lloyd. I'm uh, from South Africa. I live in Cape Town. I've been um, uh, involved with disability and uh, the uh, support of people with disabilities for the last 15 to 20 years. Um, I'm a quadriplegic. I had a diving accident and I'm, uh, I've, I've, I've been, um, my, my vision in life has been to help people with disabilities. Um, I've been very involved with uh, programs for people with disabilities, focusing on peer-to-peer -peer education. My belief is that uh, the most effective way to, to get to people with disabilities and to make them understand really what um, disability and living with a disability is about is to educate peers, to educate people with disabilities to understand the situation that they are in and to understand what secondary complications can um, influence um, their life and the quality of life. I've been involved with um, training programs in Uganda, Tanzania, Sudan, Malawi, Mozambique um, uh, and various other countries but at the moment I'm focusing on uh, the Rolling Positive program which is a HIV AIDS TB um, awareness campaign in South Africa. The focus of this program is to train peers in all our um, regions in South Africa and we have up to date um, done training in um, seven of the provinces. Uh, the impact that peer support training has had has been really immense. Uh, it is unbelievable to see what the difference is when people are given information about a situation and, a situa and the, um, uh, the complications surrounding um, issues like uh, skin care, bladder care, bowel care, but in, in, in uh, specifically focusing on, on, on sexuality and relationships and HIV AIDS and the dangers of uh, what people with disabilities are actually experiencing in the in the communities. We're not just looking at, at, at health issues, but we're also looking at the issues surrounding um, uh, the vulnerability of people with disabilities. It's a huge problem in the communities um, where people with disabilities are are abused. Oops, sorry, grab that. Uh, where people with disabilities are abused, they are um, uh, marginalized in um, the uh, not being included in, uh, say, uh, in programs um, related to HIV AIDS and TB. And this creates a huge problem. This um, makes them more vulnerable to, to the situation. In the last 18 months, we have trained 2,400 trainers uh, in, in the various regions and through uh, secondary contact we've made contact with uh, more than 24,000 people with disabilities. In our monitoring and evaluation we've seen that um, and uh, speaking to people afterwards we've, we've seen that this just um, supplying information, supplying um, uh, documentation has made a huge difference in the way that, uh, that people are behaving. It, it has um, uh, uh, resulted in people with disabilities um, realizing that they need to be tested, that they need to know their status, that they need to look after themselves, um, and that they need to take responsibility for their sexual actions and their, um, the way they live. From a person with a disability, um, uh, living with a dis disability as myself, I, I believe that um, it is really, really important to, to carry on with these programs, to educate as, more, as, as many as possible people with disabilities, to carry on uh, uh, educating people through the peer-to-peer -peer system where people will open up and will actually um, share their experiences and their problems and um, 
the situations that they are in so that we can better understand how to how to f uh, uh, face this problem and how to accompany people with disabilities and how to effectively set up programs to change people's lives and the slogan saying nothing about us without us that is so true we need to focus on that we need to involve people with disabilities more we need to look at the various disabilities everybody uh, every everyone of the various disabilities have different issues and different problems. So um, uh, I think that the development of proper programs and proper docu documentation is very important. I believe that the change that has already been made is immense and that we can just build on what we've already done.